Hello, my name is Alan Over. I am president and founder of Designer Image Technologies in Duluth, Georgia. I would like to introduce to you a new technology which uses inkjet to print on spherical objects. We call this technology Balljet. Our team of engineers over the last several years have designed this unique system in which using a standard PC, custom software, Windows-based software, we can put information into the software and print on this printer just like an office printer. However, we are printing on spherical objects, golf balls. It is as simple as using your office system. The ball jet configuration I am demonstrating was designed for a retail application, possibly a kiosk or a retail store. The system is simple and a retail clerk can operate this printer as that clerk can operate an office word processor and laser printer. I will demonstrate the simplicity of the system. I enter into the PC, the SID software, information, and I can enter text or graphics. I can change the size of the font or the font itself. At that point, I tell the printer that I'm ready to enter the information from the PC into the printer. I simply, at that point, go to a download and I tell the system move the data to the printer. I take a golf ball and at the time in which the data is in the, into the printer system, I put the golf ball into a suction cup holder and I move the ball into the suction cup. I simply at that point hit the print key and the printer begins printing the object. The ball jet printer can print up to 50 percent of the surface area of a golf ball. That's 360 degrees around the golf ball and approximately 0.8 inch wide path on the golf ball itself. Right now we are in the process of printing this golf ball. And as you can see, we have applied a 36 point font on a three quarters of the golf ball. It's already dry and prepared for play. Where from another perspective, I have an open desktop and I click the font button giving me a text box to enter information. SID software. And at that point, I can go in, as I mentioned, and change the font size or style. And the information appears on the screen. I can move the information around. And I can also look at it from a spherical perspective to see if the information is oriented on the sphere in the right location. So we see now that the SID information is, is in the right location and I am going to tell the printer by hitting the number one key that I want to send this information to the printer. Uh, at that point, I go up to this button here which is a send button and I say send and I tell it to send it to the printer. And in a couple seconds, this information is now transferred from the PC to the printer and we get a send complete icon. As I mentioned, the ball jet printing system is as simple as one, two, three. One, to download the information. Two, to turn the suction on and hold the ball. And three, to print the ball. One, two, three, print. Now that we have the data in the printer, I'm going to turn the suction cup on 
place the ball into the fixture, move it into the suction cup, and release. Now I will simply tell the printer to begin, it, begin its printing process. The blue light that you see is an ultraviolet light that is curing the ink immediately as it is applied to the ball. Graphic images can be pr printed on the ball or text. And th th this printer can print on various types of golf balls. What once took a customer three days to five days to get a personalized golf ball now can be within minutes at your retail store. Now this particular ball jet printer has the ability of printing on various size objects. The ball jet printer that we introduced to you in the kiosk desktop version can be set up to print on Christmas ornaments, ping pong balls, or other size objects like golf balls.